Good afternoon, Colin here with TechOut, and today I'm going to be doing a What's on My iPhone iOS 16 edition. So I am on the beta version of iOS 16 here in um, June, end of June of 2022. So I just want to show you guys what is on my phone and how I have my iOS 16 lock screen set up and actually a couple different lock screens that I have um, because like the Apple Watch's watch faces, you can have multiple um, screen set up and ready to go. So I'm just going to go through all that and show you guys how I have iOS 16 set up here on beta 2. Um, so the main wallpaper I use is the globe wallpaper. I just like the animation when you unlock the phone, how it kind of zooms in. Um, but I do have a few different ones. Um, this is kind of just the standard one right here um, with the wallpaper background, like the default iOS 16 wallpaper. Um, I have a weather one, which is pretty cool because it changes with the weather conditions. So if it's raining, snowing, um, cloudy, all that kind of stuff, you'll get that animated background here on your lock screen as well as your home screen. I just don't have the uh, background set on this uh, home screen. I have it just set as the uh, gradient. Um, then we just have the color one, which is just the black, which looks really nice in dark mode. Um, and then I don't know why I have another one of that. So I'm just going to delete that one. Um, but yeah, I like the Earth one because I like the way it zooms in when you unlock the phone. Just a really cool animation and it looks really nice on the home screen. Um, so as far as my home screen, I have the weather widget up here on the top as well as just my default apps pretty much here on the home page as well as my commonly used stuff um, like home apps for smart home devices and stuff like that right there in that folder. Um, everything else is pretty much just a default Apple app. And then down here on the dock, I have messages, home, wallet and YouTube. Those are just my apps that I want to be able to access no matter what page of the home screen I'm on. Um, I keep the phone up here because I don't use the phone too much. And then up here on my second screen, um, I have a battery widget, a fitness widget, which syncs with my Apple Watch, obviously. It seems to be a little buggy here in beta 2. That's why it's blank. Um, but we have my finance apps just for my different uh, bank account and stuff like that, credit cards, uh, PayPal, all that kind of stuff that I use on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, we have the stuff here for my insulin pump right here, Dexcom, SugarMate, T-Connect, um, because I am a type 1 diabetic. And then right here we have food apps, which are just, you know, points and stuff like that for ordering food and all that different kind of stuff. T-Mobile app, because I have T-Mobile, so that's where I go to uh, mostly just pay my bill. I don't really use it for anything else. Um, right here we have some shopping apps, Best Buy, eBay, FedEx, uh, stuff like that for tracking orders that I uh, order in these apps. Um, the Apple Store, B&H Photo. Uh, Amazon, of course. Um, we have the different weather apps I use, AccuWeather, Weather, and the Weather Channel. Um, I do like the weather app here in iOS 16. It gives you a lot more information um, for forecast and uh, future day stuff, stuff like that. I have Reddit right here. Uh, utilities, which are more just default Apple apps. Pretty much stuff I don't use. I'll use the calculator time to time. Um, stuff like that, maybe measure time to time, the watch app for updating my Apple Watch and customizing it and that kind of stuff. And then these over here I really never use. Um, we have social, TikTok, Instagram, Discord, and Snapchat. You can follow me on Instagram and TikTok at uh, TechOutOfficial on YT. Uh, YouTube Studio for replying to you guys' comments and uh, viewing stuff on my YouTube channel and stuff like that. Twitter and FindMy for my AirTag basically. Um, pretty much all I use that for. And that is all I have on my... Uh, iPhone's home screen. There's a couple apps in here, like wallpaper apps and stuff like that, that I don't um, have on the home screen, but that is pretty much it. Everything else that I use on a day-to-day -day basis is here on the home screen. So that is how I have my iPhone set up, and that is what my iPhone 13 Pro Max looks like on iOS 16 Beta 2. I'm Colin with TechOut. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and as always, have a great day.